Thank you, Madam Speaker. Madam Speaker, today I stand in solidarity with the Democratic Republic of Congo that has turned out to be a conflict zone leading to massive deaths and mass displacement. According to the United Nations, the conflict has since recorded the largest humanitarian crisis in Africa. Congolese President Felix Tshisekedi warns that the regional tensions could escalate into a full-blown war if the situation is not contained. With the DRC's entry into the East African community and the upcoming general elections in 2023, the robust intervention of the East African Regional Bloc is critical to fostering peace between the DRC and its neighbor, neighbors, Rwanda. Uh, why did I decide to wear this outfit, the flag, today? I met a number of women, and so far, over 300,000 people have been displaced and forced to flee from their homes in Route Shuru and Bonagana since the reemergence of war. Kenya, through the East African Community Regional Bloc, was appointed to mediate the peace talks between DRC and Rwanda. The former president of Kenya, His Excellency Uhuru Kenyatta, is currently convening peace dialogues in Nairobi a week after the Kenya government commissioned its army to DRC. So, your, uh, Madam Speaker, my wearing this outfit today is because I met the women uh, of DRC, some of whom have lived in Kenya for the last 20 years and are really, really ha happy that our country hosted them, but they are looking and crying for peace in their country. Women are being raped, defied, displaced. So as I wear this flag today, I came out from the breakfast meeting, I walked out with the flag and I told them I will bring awareness throughout the day and stand with them in solidarity and that's why I'm donning the flag. And as, as a parliament, we have so many friendship groups. I'm going to try and uh, I notice we're trying to create a friendship group between uh, in our parliament for in solidarity with Ukraine. I also intend to stand, uh, create a friendship group in solidarity with DRC so that together all of us can call for peace. It has, uh, charity begins at home and our neighbors are crying for help, especially women and children. Uh, I stand guided, Madam Speaker.